Hello, I'm going to show you the difference between a mention and a reply on Twitter. And it really boils down to one little symbol, and that is this. The little at symbol, which leads off anyone's handle. Now, if you'll notice, uh, anyone's username in Twitter leads off with the at symbol. Um, to mention someone or tag their user, you have your their user handle, you have to use the at symbol leading into their username, otherwise it will not tag that person. Now, the way this correlates to composing a tweet. So, if I'm having a conversation with someone and someone tweets to me, hey Rachel, what did you think of Captain America Civil War? Uh, I can message back to them if this were their Twitter handle. Let's live stream. I really liked it. Uh, not as good as Winter Soldier. Okay, now I have let off this tweet with the at symbol, which is part of mentioning or replying to the person who tweeted at me in the first place. This makes this tweet a reply because it is leading off with an at symbol. So I'm just going to copy that really quick so I have to type it again. So. The reason that matters is because on your home screen, your profile screen of Twitter, so where everybody can see everything you're about, um, everything always lands on this first tab, Tweets. So anything that is a tweet means anything that you've tweeted that does not lead off with an at symbol. Now, it might mention people uh, in your Twitter handle, or in, in the tweet rather, um, but it's not going to be a reply, okay? So for instance, this is a tweet I retweeted and that is not a reply, it's someone where they mention somebody because their handle appears within the text of the tweet but does not lead it off. Now, I'll show you at the top here. So if I, you look at my tweets tab, but then look at my tweets and replies tab, suddenly the top tweet is a reply, which you couldn't see in the tweets column, but you can see in the reply. And again, it's me directly uh, replying or sending a direct tweet to somebody's handle, leading off with the at symbol, and having the text of my message thereafter. Because I've let off with that at symbol, it does not appear as a regular tweet. It rather is classified as a reply. All right, so now if you want to make sure that a tweet to someone will show up first in your tweets column, all you need to do is type something in front of that at symbol. And you might see this a lot on Twitter where people will use a little hack where they'll just put a period. It's very small, it's, it's out of the way. Uh, it's an easy way to just put something in front of that at symbol, which now if I tweet this out, it's going to appear in my tweet column and not in the necessarily in the replies column. All right. Now it's in the replies column actually, but it's also in the tweet column. And there it is. I'm going to go ahead and delete that one because I didn't actually have a conversation there. Um, so to get around this also, you can just make it a mention by type leading off with some more text. Like, I really liked it. And then mentioning that person's Twitter handle. Though it wasn't as good as Winter Soldier. So again, that's another way to get around where I am still mentioning and tagging that user, but since I'm not leading off with the at symbol, this will appear in my tweet, my primary tweet call, uh, tab when someone lands on my profile versus the tweets and replies. That is the difference between a reply and a mention on Twitter.